Yo, Jenny Gang, what it do? So we're back for another Jenny Gang YouTube production. Like the video, L-I-K-E, like the video, please. Turn on post notifications so you'll always get my sweet little uploads. And share the video. So, gang, we have not done a Alexis Ware video in a long time. Simply because... I felt like there's nothing new coming out and there's only all these speculations and Lord knows we don't need any more speculations in the Lexus Ware case. I think we all have given our opinion. We all have a person in mind we feel like might have done something. It's just so much with that case. However, okay, we have got some new um, stuff rather from the horse's mouth. So shout out to this YouTuber. Her name is Jay Chesson. And I'm going to make sure I link her video on my video because Alexis Ware's baby daddy, TJ, decided to give Jay Chesson this interview. So y'all know he had to feel, feel really comfortable. No one else he would do that for, I'm sure. So I'm going to make sure I give y'all the original. But I am going to just chime in on some of my thoughts when I hear things on this interview. So shall we begin? On, and you could have went on Dateline, you could have talked to Dateline, you could have talked to Alexis, ever tell you that she was afraid of a certain someone, an individual, a man, a woman. Did she say, TJ, I'm afraid of a person? Most definitely did not. All, all, like, all she kept saying is she kept telling me, like, that whole week, you know what I'm saying, the, the, the price when she went missing. She just kept telling me, uh, she kept seeing me down in the car wreck and stuff like that, but she never told me that anybody was after her or none of that, because she know how I'm coming behind her, right or wrong, together or not. In fact, she know how I'm coming behind her. But though she never told me, nobody was after her. Did she ever mention, in quote unquote, the devil? No, she never told me none of that. None of that. I didn't hear none of that, so her mama said it. Gotcha. I got you. When you heard that, what did you think? It was another, it was another dude involved she was dealing with. I got you. Okay. Let me ask you this question. Did Alexis, did Alexis date a lot of different men? Well, when I was locked, I did nine months. You know what I'm saying? I can't say what, what she had going on. All I know is she played her part. She held me down and made sure I came home with my son. What she had going on, I didn't find out until I got out. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and stuff started to come to me. And so me and her separated. Okay. And, and, like I said, I, I don't know. Before I fact, I never seen it firsthand. Okay. Uh, second question. How is your son? And do you get to see your son as often as you like? Oh, I got my son, most definitely. My son in the house right now. He's good. I, he's spoiled. I got him. I take care of him. Okay. And you know what I'm saying? Right now, I'm in court. You know, still keep fighting. Keep custody of him. But yeah, I got him. So who's trying to take custody? Uh, the, the, uh, the grandmother. Who's the grandmother? My brother. What's her name? My brother. Mm -hmm. Okay. What's your relationship like with Miss Alberta right now? Good question. We do not speak at all. Not at all. And do you know why? Why? I don't even know why. I can't even ask that question. What what I think is why? Because she got mad because I sent that message around about my big mama having a fail with a married man. She told me not to say nothing about it. And when they got out there, you know what I'm saying? They're not with not spoke my mind because it was hiding a lot of shit. She felt some type of weight. And that's when I started hearing, oh, she put me in court and all this and this and that. And we had no more words to say out there. We're going to get to that. We're going to get to that. Okay, let's stop it right there. So, so far, she just asked him, y'all heard, you know, was Alexis dealing with other men? He said he kind of heard a little bit of stuff, but y'all know he was, you know, behind the walls. But also, a key factor I think is important here, him and her mom do not get along. I remember there was a battle for the kids in the beginning. He says now he has the son, but he's going back and forth to try to fight that and make sure he can keep the son with Alexis Ware's mom. Alexis, Alexis Ware's mom is, you know, a controversial character in this story. 
there are rumors that her and her mom didn't get along, rumors that her and her mom were kind of like two friends that battled over different men, things like that, like one jealous of the other. There's rumors that she got herself and her mom a BBL. All speculation and all alleged, okay? And everything I'm saying is not meant to harm anyone's reputation. In this video, I want to exercise my right to use fair use. It's just for entertainment purposes. Um, that's it. So, pretty informative so far, especially that with the mom. But let's keep going. That's in my, my, my list of questions. So, let me just get to number three because I don't want to miss nothing. Was Alexis supposed to testify against you? No, 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 no. I think she testified against me when she knows she knows nothing about my case. So you know that's everywhere though, TJ, right? Yeah. You, you know a lot of people think that and a lot of people base their theory on that that she was supposed to testify no. against you. No. No. She was not supposed to testify against me. Hmm. Um. She helped you get a lawyer? So let's pause right there. So did Alexis wear or disappear or TJ make her disappear because she was going to testify against him? That right there doesn't make sense. Even though y'all know if you've been keeping up with the case, there is some crazy stuff supposedly that went on between Alexis wearing her baby daddy. There are some allegations of domestic violence, allegations of cheating, allegations of him getting another woman pregnant. That does not have anything to do with the N word though. Okay. But it doesn't make sense for her to have went to say she's going to testify against him when there's rumors. And I think he mentions it in this interview. She dropped 20 stacks to even get him out of jail. So why do that just to go back and testify? I don't really know if that makes sense, but let's keep listening. Oh, yeah. She, she got a lawyer. She got me a lawyer. Yes, she did. Did she ever talk to you about her finances? Uh, she, I know she had... Uh, um she had did some uh, PPP loan or whatever. Yeah, because I was just about to ask you about the PPP loans. Yeah, she, she, she had did uh, either like one or two times. Uh-huh. You know, you know it's public records, right? Right, right, right. So but, did, she uh, yeah. him, did she finesse him a little bit? You know, so I know she had one for the beauty salon, and then right. she had another one um, for a dance company. See that? I didn't know about that one. <laughs> I didn't. All right, I think that's very juicy information. So, Alexis Ware had two PPP loans, allegedly. I know PPP loans are definitely public record. And I know she did have a hell of a lifestyle. You know, there's confusion about whether she was a hairdresser, makeup artist, dancer by night. We are runner girl, you know, one of the girls who run the packages. We don't really know, but I'm going to say... If she is still amongst us, I'll be, I would hurt my baby daddy for telling people that. Even though it's public information, don't be discussing my finances. Like, because we don't know, y'all. I know some people say she's gone. She might be. It is very likely that she's gone. But if she's not, Greenville, Anderson, Spotenberg, Texas, that's done told all her business. And I wouldn't even want to come back. And if I did, I'd line everybody up one by one. Let's let's go around because why is y'all all in my business? Just find me. Oh, my I didn't know it's a lot of people I didn't know. Mm -hmm. Right. So did she tell so she didn't say, Hey, you know what, TJ, I took out some PPP loans real quick. You told me about the one with the business loan. That's it. I ain't know nothing about the other. She said she thought about doing another. I'm getting ready to speed this up, y'all. So you know my other you know my live a couple of days ago, we was talking about the PPP loans and I was telling Chess Gang that there was about ten to thirteen flags of reports on her. Right, right. Wow. They was hating. So she wasn't lying about that, was she? Get in your car. Why couldn't they just stay in her car? Yes, I have a doubt. Okay, she, uh, when I got y'all, 